Hello everybody, I'm Court Gaming and welcome to Kona. You all know that I did like Firewatch a while back. It was quite a surprise hit of this year. Yeah, it was released this year. And this is sort of similar, there's some sort of mystery going on up in Canada. And as you can see, it's pretty gorgeous. So, let's check it out. I would like to create a new game. Carl Faubert, private detective, had just traveled thousands of kilometers from Montreal to reach this remote middle-of-nowhere area, situated near the far northern Lake Atamibek. Granted, this was a great distance to cover for a sole client, but word had it that he was a particularly wealthy one. Oh, we're in! Sweet! Alrighty then. So, we are in Canada! Lake Atomipec! He said like I should know that, like it's some sort of famous lake. Love Mom. What was that? Matches? Some tobacco, a flashlight, a journal, a map. I had to drive a bit further north in order to meet with wealthy industrialist William Hamilton. Okay. Hamilton is waiting for Carl in the general store. It was time for him to get down to business. Can I Hamilton grab that butt too? His owner, who had acquired various businesses as well as metal mines in this northern region. I mean, you shouldn't litter. I want to pick up that butt. Stamp it out at least. Stamp it. That's good. Don't want to start a forest fire, although it might be too cold for that. Maybe. Let's get driving. Hamilton never mentioned a road blocking barrier. Oh. Why was it needed here in the back of beyond? That would, however, be a mystery for another day. Carl had waited long enough for someone to come and raise it. Can I raise it myself or do Carl I have to go on foot? On place. He had to get back on the road. Hello, can anyone raise this for me? Hamilton no doubt knew who managed the barrier. Carl wanted to give him a call, but that would have been too easy though, as sure enough, the line was acting up. Is there a manual? Manastan! Is that like a... a magical place of mana? Welcome to Manastan! Il ifera bon vivre. Vivre, I think that's... something. Life, maybe? Whatever. Let's read it. The journey ahead was calling. The case won't close itself. Wait, can I... Ah, there we go. Le nord du Québec et ses ressources inapplicables. Yes, sure. I took it French, like, in, in grade school, but it didn't stick, obviously. Anything useful in here? If anyone knows French, let me know in the comments below what if there's anything useful here. But it doesn't seem like it. So do I have to go on foot? Or can I, like, wrestle this thing open? There might be something up in the tower as well. Carl had a lot on his plate. He had to get back on the road. Shimmy it! With my, uh... Thingy. I would like to select this. Wait, I have to combine stuff. Alright, so I don't think I have what it takes. We have uh, no plier or whatever that is. Still not a soul in sight. There was no point in waiting any longer. Carl had to figure this one out by himself. Yep, you know, there's probably going to be a plier up in that uh, guard tower there, a watchtower. What are these? Oh. Okay. So we got some uh, Native American things going on too. What was that? Sound like someone's stalking me in the bushes. Don't like the sound of that. Hey there. Come on. Come. Oh, this is one of those games that doesn't lock the mouse into place. So every time I look to the right, my mouse goes onto the other screen. And if I click it there, I would uh, K 
kind of re or um, get knocked out of the game. That's pretty bad. Doesn't seem like there's a way to fix that. Which is poop. But I guess we'll have to make do. If you see me doing one of these, that's me putting my mouse back on th this, the right monitor. Oh, we got that. That should help. And was that a medkit? I did see, like, um, if I put up my map. Ah, here we go. We got, like, a uh, system here. We got health, temperature, and stress, and weight. So there might be uh, times when um, we're out in the uh, snow, for example. We gotta be careful not to freeze to death. So that's gonna be a added benefit, sort of like um, the long dark. But there's no like hunger, which is probably good. Too much, mu too much micromanagement would be not ideal for an adventure game, as it were, a story-driven game. Fits well with the long dark, though. All right, I want to use this. Made quick work of the chain. What better way to investigate vandals than to get into their shoes? Carl, the professional vandal, thought, reveling in the irony of the situation. Is that guy gonna narrate the whole thing? I mean, I'm not complaining. Can I pick that up? Don't litter. Also, that is a tin can. You gotta recycle. All right, let's get in and get driving. William Hamilton enjoyed a lavish country. Oh, I can do the, this on my own. Not too far from Ooh, this is very narrow. But we made it. Anything of value out here? While I go on autopilot? The local populace was divided when it came to the affluent men. Some saw a wealthy philanthropist dedicated to improving the region's economy. Others, an aging Englishman who would do anything to further his fortunes. And those ones hated him enough to go on about scheming against him. I mean, I feel like there shouldn't be anything uh, on the side of the road right here. Oh, there is something there. What was that? Oh, just some rocks. Never mind then. Oh, it started snowing. That's bad. Bad for my temperature. And probably the slipperiness of the road. There's gonna be like ice slicks. Don't want to get into an accident. But I don't see any ice was yet. Not made aware that winter would come early this year. The North made clear who was the boss up there. Snow. Wait, what was that? Care much about the date when it felt like dumping his first load of the year. Can I get out? Oh, I can't get out. But I want to see what that was. Something red? What is that? Like a... Well, a cart? Said cart gaming? <laughs> a cart of trash. Just like this one. Alright, oh, there's ice. We better be careful. Slow down. Always go slower when there's ice out. Words of wisdom. Also, I should be driving on the right side of the road. I think they have uh, right hand traffic in Canada, too. Pretty sure. They are civilized like that. <clears throat> no offense to anyone from those countries. Hamilton had recently acquired a few local businesses, but the last straw was the reopening of a mine, which gave rise to a wave of protests and threats from the Cree people. Oh, we got some Cree! I'm a big fan of uh, Native American stuff. Also in games. Oh shit! Wait, why did, why did you honk at me? I was totally like on the side of the road almost. But we better be uh, pretty careful. Given these circumstances, Carl reckoned that a good number of people must be feeling compelled to oppose Hamilton in one way or another. So far, only the industrialist's house had been a target, but soon enough, Carl thought, the target would 
become the man himself. I wonder if I could have been hit by that uh, car, by the way. If I was on the side of the road, or his side of the road. Or if he'd like, um, oh, if he'd um, avoided me anyway. He might have been a master driver. Unlike me. Eastern Atamipek. Wait, was that a stop? Should I be going in there? Oh, oh, sorry, sorry, sir. That was your mailbox. I think you, I think you went all right, though. It survived. It was the sturdy one. Should I be going in here? Can I check my map from here? Like three, three, three. Oh, I have to hold it. Okay. So that's not what I wanted. It's just like a uh, roundabout. But there's a mailbox here. I feel like we should check it out. We might find some secrets. Um. Oh, that's another car. I almost thought it was a um, crashed car. Carl was dying to stretch his legs. But he had to stay focused on the task at hand. Aww. Alright, so we want to get to the um, gas station. And this should loop around to the road again. Nice. Oh, there's another one over there. Another mailbox. So, let's see. Safe, dr super safe, super safe. The truck was running on fumes. Good thing that the general store was close by. Oh no, oh no, oh no. Don't drive off the road now. We're super close. We can put that away now, I think. In here. The general store. I'm just gonna park here if that's okay. Also, we got a cold icon. I should see my temperature start dropping now. 98%. Yeah. Hello? Close the door. It's only polite when it's cold out. Anyone home? Oh. Can I grab some? Good old sugar and caffeine. Various canned fish. Not a fan of canned fish, or fish in general. I'm allergic. What happened here? Was there a fight, or did this just... break? It might have just broken under the weight. But it is a mess. Oh, I want some of those. Those should be pretty handy. Oh, shit. An explosion suddenly occurred outside. What? Better not have been my car. What was that? Hello? I want to check everything in here first, though. Did I have a flashlight? Did I did, didn't I? At number one. Good. A radiator without power is as good as a wood stove without logs. What are these? Just pieces of wood? You sell those? Aha. See, it paid off to come back in here. Jumping from that height was akin to tempting death. Perhaps that man on the snowmobile had seen enough of this world already. By all appearances, the general store also served as a post office. Letters and packages awaited the locals' daily visit. But I can open this one! Let's snoop! Monsieur Lamoth! If anyone wants to translate that in the comments, 
I'd appreciate it. Something about the Olympics, I think. Uh, oh, did I take it? I mean, shouldn't I put it back? Oh, well, I guess I'll grab that too. Whatever that was. What was that? In special. A spark plug? That might be handy at some point. Is this the same brochure? I'm pretty sure it is. Let's double check. I think so. The people of Manastan. Let's get rid of that. Instructions pour ouvrir la caisse en registrus. Also, like, registering a post box or something? Oh, to open the cash register, punch the price, press sale, turn the crank... Oh, so if I... Can I use that thing? Can I go back to my documents or something? And read oh, that letter? In his work, always carried his log on him, in which he scribbled down thoughts and leads alike during the course of his investigations. I am a PI, if you haven't noticed. The general store. All this mess suggests vandals or thieves being there not long ago. Could they be the ones messing with Hamilton's manor? But I can't read the letter again, it seems. Whatever happened here, things got pretty rough. And not a trace of Hamilton. I should probably get the breakers back on. The note explained that the garage and the store couldn't be supplied with electricity at the same time. Okay, so let's see which one is the garage. I probably want the garage because I have checked out the store already. So the garage should have power now. Maintaining oh shit! Exposure, Carl recalled something from his military training. Wolves always stay away from populated areas. Wait, was it about bears? These bears are not even cold. How do they manage that? Oh, is this like coffee? The drawer of coffee? I want this. You don't leave ammunition out in the open like this? Was Gilles Lachance that careless? Duct tape! Always handy. And matches. Ah, Finding garage key. key is easy. Finding the right keyhole, not so much. Maybe I can put my um, vehicle next to the pump and pump it up. Gilles Lachance, Carl recollected, was the general store's manager. Should Hamilton not be available, he was the man to talk to. Or what if Hamilton had moved up his appointment with his physician? Some guy from Montreal is supposed to meet me at the general store. I gotta swing by Dr. Boupre first, so I'll be running late. I want you to welcome him and please be kind. Yes, please be kind. Be kind, rewind. The snowstorm pummeled everything in its path. Carl was not surprised when he heard no tone. Can I loot this? Wait. Why was there... Why did the... One and three... Wait, didn't that note back here say something about the cash register? Was there a code? This one. Turn the crank two times. Uh, punch the machine if it doesn't work. Punch the price. Press sale. Turn the crank two times. Price, sale, two cranks. Price, sale, two cranks. Price, sale, 
Two cranks. Haha. -ha. We got monies. And a list According of goods. Log, it seemed like the whole village owed some money to the general store. Carl was far more interested in the bunch of nearby addresses he had just gotten his hands on, though. Oh, that's probably going to be good. You would know the uh, local residents now. I'm just going to leave the money, I guess. I'm a PI. I'm a good guy. Ish. Alright. Let's hope we don't get eaten by wolves when we check out the garage. However, that is going to be a tale for the day. If you like this video and want to see more of it, hit that thumbs up and leave a comment below and subscribe if you haven't already. Thank you for watching. I will see you guys next time.